Hi, I'm a Bullis student tutor, and today we'll be talking about the midpoint of a circle. Before we get started with the midpoint of a circle, we have to know the terminology. So first, we have the diameter. The diameter is from one point at the end of the circle to the next. The next thing that we need to know is a radius. The radius is half of the amount of the diameter, also known as D equals R times 2. So now we get to the question, how can we find the midpoint if we're only given two endpoints? So here we have negative 2, 2, and at the, under, at the other end is 4, 2. So this right here is our most important formula for finding the midpoint when you're given two ending points. So now that we know the formula and now that we've gotten our given endpoints, it's time to do some math. So as you can see, I've circled the two x points that I were given and I've labeled them x1 and x2. Now we're going to plug them into our equation. So we'll start with x1 x1 has been given to us as negative 2 plus x2, which is a positive 4. Now I have just circled the y values that were given to us. They are both positive 2, so they will both be the same. But if they weren't the same number, you would put the top one as y1 and the bottom one as y2. So in this equation, it would be 2 plus 2. Now that we've plugged in all of our values, it's time to solve. So this is just simple arithmetic, so it should be really easy. Negative 2 plus 4 is 2 over 2. The next point would be 2 plus 2 over 2, which is 4 over 2. So when you have finished doing your addition, you then divide by the, by the denominator on the bottom. So for this equation, it'll be 2. So you're dividing 2 over 2, and then on the next side, it's 4 over 2, which ends up making the point 1, 2. So in conclusion to this video, remember this formula to find the midpoint of a circle. This has been a Bullis Student Tutors video. Thank you.